Hey, I just go, uh, went to the PVP of summer school and uh, I find in one of the uh, lecture make a really good analogy so I think it'd be good to share. Uh, the physical understanding of a plasma heating, we can think about analogy of a heating of water. There are the three uh, main ways to do that. Uh, ohmic heating, electrocyclotron heating, ECH, or ion cyclotron heating, ICH, or neutral beam heating. So, just look at the plasma side. Basically, the you can think it just a, that the plasma is a resistor, and it, and we run the current across it. Then we have the power of I square R, and the uh, ECH and ICH have some has a knowledge. Uh, we can use the use the knowledge of a lambda resonance. Um, and the, the neutral beam heating basically ionizes the ion and uh, and accelerated ionizes the, the a particle and uh, accelerated using high voltage and adding electron to make it neutral and then dump it into the into the into the fusion device. So back into the heating water, which is really simple and nice to understand. If you want to heat a tub of water. Um, one way, we, even if it's not safe, is, uh, is to run through, um, run a current through the water. Uh, of course, I assume the water is not a perfect H2O. And uh, that's all make heating, basically run, run, uh, run a current through water. And uh, the next way is just microwave the water because uh, microwave have the same frequency length of like the resonance, like resonance of uh, H2O. Of water and oil, um, and the, the neutral beam injection is pretty much adding hot water or you know fast uh, neutral neutral particles into the into the plasma. Or in this, in the sense of heating water, is basically adding hot water into cold water. So I think it's pretty good. And also, I will link. I put the link of the PVP L Summer School. It's an open source. Basically, you can go to take a look at the videos um, online, and it's and the, the PowerPoint is there. I will uh, put the link uh, in the description.